the word for today, there is God. So with Jesus, God will surely give us all things. Romans 8, 32. Do you collect Bible promises for challenging time? When your collection seems inadequate, do you add to it, thinking, I just haven't found the right promise yet? Claiming the promise without understanding the all-sufficiency of the promiser can disappoint you. Since there is no lack in God, he is all you need, and he is all you will ever need. The Bible says, he can do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine. Ephesians 3.20 Seeking answers during a difficult time, author Hannah Withal Smith visited a respected Bible teacher. After listening attentively, the teacher told her, Yes, all you say may be very true, but then, in spite of it all, there is God. Frustrated, Hannah responded, Surely you did not understand how very serious my difficulties are. Oh yes, I did, but then, as I tell you, there is God. Several visits later, after hearing the same response, there is God, the light dawned. She realized she had the answer she needed. God alone was enough for all her needs. She writes, The all-sufficiency of God ought to be to us as the all-sufficiency of a good mother is to her child. Her presence and love make all fears disappear. She doesn't need to make any promises and explanations. She alone is all that the child needs. All God's blessings come in one package, himself. Paul reminds you, everything belongs to you because you belong to Christ and Christ belongs to God. 1 Corinthians 3, 22-23 You will get what you need because you are his redeemed child. That is the word for today.